beauties, it's me, Allegra. I thought it would be really fun today to hop on and share everything I bought this week, new makeup 2022, and my makeup haul, my makeup haul of the week. I did get plenty of new makeup. I'm slightly addicted. Um, you know, I freely admit that. Anyway, beauties, let me go ahead and show you exactly what I got. Some of this, you know, some of it I've tried, some of it I haven't. So let me get into it now. This I just tried that I just, I'm actually wearing this right now. This is a new Too Faced lip injection, but this is a lipstick and a lip plumper in one. So this is a liquid lipstick, but it plumps just like the traditional Too Faced lip injection. I did get this shade O Queen, or is that size queen? I've been, per I've purchased so many of these kind of shades lately. I don't know what has gotten into me, but I'm crazy. I like wearing this shade now. I didn't used to like to wear it. I used to always wear more of a nude brown, but now I'm really into this kind of, I don't know if you, I feel like it's a little on the mauve side. Anywho, let's keep it moving. Now this I picked up, I haven't had a chance to try it yet, but it's the new Lancome uh, Regenerate Lift Makeup. It does have sunscreen in it, 27. I wish it had more sunscreen because I am addicted to sunscreen products and I have to say beauties I've been wearing my sunscreen makeup out in the sun and the heat no other sunscreen and it's they work they really do work because I haven't gotten a sunburn um, and that's all I'll have on my face is like my Estee Lauder foundation with the SPF and they it really does work because I have not <laughs> like I said I haven't gotten a sunburn so um, but 27 is I feel like that I'd be scared that that's too low for me because I'm used to like the Estee Lauder has 40 SPF 45 so I, I feel like that's my comfort zone so anywho I'm, I wouldn't be wearing this as sunscreen I would definitely wear another sunscreen with this because I feel like 27 would be too low for me but have you beauties tried this yet I haven't tried it but I'll be back and we will test it out together so then I did pick this up I oh I have tried this before this is the Redken all soft oh did I got the conditioner why did I get the conditioner what am I gonna do for shampoo what did I get for shampoo <laughs> okay I don't know I do have shampoo I must have shampoo that's why I only got the conditioner because I have purchased this shampoo and condition for so good Redken is such a great hair brand I mean the Redken anti-frizz amazing the anti-frizz line uh so I, I have tried all soft before I thought I'd mix it up usually I do purchase anti-frizz the red one but this time I thought you know let me go buck wild and I got the the all soft which is also just as good and then beauties I got this elf putty bronzer can't wait to try this i know some of you beauties i believe april said that there is a luminous putty product from elf now i got to try that i'm gonna go look as soon as i'm done hanging out with you beauties i'm gonna go try to find it because i believe she mentioned that there's a luminous one too so there's the blush the bronzer and a luminous product now and the blush isn't the blush gorgeous i'm that blush is beautiful seriously better than high end so drugstore better than high end so anyway beauties let me see here oh i used this already i got a new uh I, this is in my makeup bag so some yeah somewhere here but i got a new uh maybelline sky high mascara but i got the waterproof so the pink packaging is the waterproof and prior i had purchased the one that wasn't waterproof so i wanted to get the waterproof one but i have to say this mascara is from amazing it was all sold out in store. I got the last one. But I do have to say, I was kind of expecting more from the waterproofing. It did, you know, maybe it stayed waterproof, but maybe it was the initial application, but it was kind of, it did transfer into my hooding. So, you know, it's my hooding is very oily. It's very hot here, very humid. So I didn't, I wish it didn't do that. It didn't, didn't, didn't do that. But anywho, it's neither here nor there. That's a beautiful, I'm, I'm, sure, I'm sure a lot of you beauties have tried it. The Maybelline Sky High Mascara is just amazing. It's unbelievable. But, uh, you know, to be honest, I am wearing that Bite Beauty Mascara now that I got in a Ipsy box. I believe that's, a, that's amazing. It is, you know, higher priced. But it doesn't transfer into my hooding. It stays put. It's, it's, it makes your lashes so thick, so long. That That's an amazing mascara. So I also have that here somewhere, but I'll show you guys another day. I'll do like a little video and I'll show you guys because it's it really makes a huge difference. It's that good. It makes an instant, <laughs> instantly visible results. 
it's that good so anyway beauties here i got oh i got this this i'm not sure if this is new i've never sold this before but this is the elf putty primer but it's vitamin c infused so i can't wait to try this also i'm hoping this is brightening i would love to smell it right now because it's gonna because i'm so some of the putties smell so good i had what was it cookies and cream maybe if this kind of smells citrusy i would love that i just love that nice scents so let's see if it has this no it doesn't have a scent which is good because a lot of people don't like scents but hopefully it does have that brightening those brightening properties because it has vitamin c it's the c bright so i'll be back and we'll try this out as well and then i got this i have oh i did try this did i try this i'm not sure if i tried this but i've heard amazing things about this this is the redken deep clean dry foam shampoo so i can't wait to try it i don't think i tried this but i've seen amazing videos on tiktok and you on instagram and people were showing it and i i'll be back i'll let you know how it worked out for me because um you know i love using dry shampoo although i only now i because i a lot of you beauties had even said dry shampoo is not good for your hair i was using it like daily but now i see i just use it like once a week maybe twice a week the most and then the other days i let the oils kind of stay in my hair and just brush them through and i i work with them you know because i don't want to wash my hair too much like like a lot of you dolls you know i'm just trying to not wash my hair too much just once a week i would love that you know and especially now i did this top knot that i love i saw chris appleton i gotta come back and show you or if you guys see chris appleton if you love those buns he did a tutorial with the bun and i and it was so easy and i did it and my i love the bun wearing the bun now it's so cute it's almost like a bridget bardot bun and ugh, he i love chris appleton do you guys watch him um he, he i learned so much about doing my hair from him and it just makes me so happy because i never knew how to do my hair and i don't go to the salon you know it's i've never really gone to the salon and got my hair done so i love i learned so much from him and he makes ugh, i'm so happy so then i got this here now this is beautiful i got this this is from milk makeup now i didn't realize milk makeup is clean makeup it's clean beauty i didn't know that i knew they were vegan and cruelty free but i didn't know they were clean beauty but I got the Sunshine Skin Tint. This has SPF 30 sunscreen, but this is gives your skin a gorgeous, dewy, gorgeous, ooh, ooey gooey, you know, dewy, gl glowing skin look. It's beautiful. It feels so good on your skin. So I did pick one of these up. And then I picked up these Kiss Lashes. They say they're new, my lash, but better. So I will, you know, I'll come back and we'll try everything out together. We'll do like testing new makeup, <laughs> testing out. We'll put, I'll put all this away so we can test it out together. So then let's see here. I got another one of these because I ran out. I'm going to do an empty soon. I've got, I'm so proud of myself. I've been using up so much makeup. Uh, you know, some of you might not understand <laughs> what I mean by that, but I used to like have my foundation, have my products and I wouldn't use them. I was so scared I would run out. You know thankfully i can afford now and people are good enough to send me but i didn't used to have that so i used to hold on to my foundation and i wouldn't use it and i don't know you know if some of you might be able to relate to what i'm saying so anyway now anyway i have been using up all my foundation i've been using it and loving it so i'm so happy so i went up through a whole thing of this i got another one because i love this even though it's kind of hard to work with i just love it it's it's almost like it's my comfort but it's my comfort you know it's my like my comfort blanket or what's the what's the phrase it's, it just makes me feel comforted to put it on i don't know what it's confidence boosting for me because i just feel like when i put it on uh i feel like i look good i feel confident i don't know how to describe it so that's my confidence boosting makeup this the dior spray dior foundation is i think it's amazing it just makes you look so glowy and beautiful I'm actually wearing the Dior Flash today and then the other Dior, I have another Dior, Dior Forever, so I'm wearing that. And it gives you a just a dewy, beautiful glow to your skin. It's like just, I feel like it looks very youthful. It's a juicy kind of skin. <laughs> so anyway, beauties, then I got here, I got this Dior Attic Lip Glow. So this is, I got the, this is the Cherry Oil Infused, so beautiful. See, that's another product. I don't like to use it too much because I want to treasure it. I don't want it to run. I like the pa the packaging. It just makes you feel so bougie. 
but I will be I will use it guys I will <laughs> so then I got this this is a new lipstick this is from makeup forever rouge artist rouge artist forever matte lipstick so I got this shade 190 and I guess this is oh 24 hour ultra matte I so supposedly this is gonna last 24 hours it comes in this beautiful you know packaging here so I'll be back and we can try that out as well. I'm re Although I want to try out right now, 24 hour lipstick. That sounds amazing. I was just at a party tonight and I just it was so annoying. And guys, I don't know what the heck is going on. I've, I've been having strangest reactions ever with my makeup. I had makeup, it worked perfectly. And the next day it works horrible. It's, I don't know if it's my skin or the weather, cause it's so hot, you know. But I had uh, the benefit a uh, lip tint it was the other day it stayed for hours it stayed perfect today I, so i said let me wear it to the party i wore it to the party it kept coming off uh, maybe i was drinking more drinks than usual i don't know it was annoying and i was i had to keep putting it on and then i felt bad because i told you guys it didn't budge and it was budging all night but anywho I'm, i got another pair of these these are eyelor three quarter quarter three fourth length lashes these are beautiful they look so natural they're gorgeous they pop right on they're reusable they're beautiful it makes a beautiful natural effect and they go on your eyes very easily so what is better than that then i got these lashes these are actually iggy azalea times bh cosmetics lashes that she came out with and the packaging is beautiful so i'm gonna try these out oh, look at them they're kind of they're very beautiful totally plastic <laughs> i think i got two of these i saw someone wearing them in a video it looked so good i was like what is she wearing and then lo and behold those were the lashes so i was like let me go ahead them. they were like five dollars and um then i got here the fenty heat lip plumper also very this is actually more heat and tingling maybe than the the lip injection from Too Faced so if you don't like the burning sensation of the lip plumper I don't know if you would like this I personally was it was starting to bother me it was this one guys my battery died so I had to go charge it but I believe I was telling you beauties about this uh Fenty Beauty Heat this is a lip plumper lip gloss and I, I, I was, this has been out for a while, but I just got it and I got lemon lava, but it, it does burn and tingle a lot. Now, this one that I was, that I'm wearing from Too Faced has stopped burning and stopped tingling. So I guess it does stop. In comparison though, this is a walk in the park, the Too Faced compared to the Fenty Heat. This is very long lasting though. This is, like I said, the Too Faced and it just, it's lasting and lasting. I don't know. I think, you know what it is? When I went to the party time, my lips kept coming off going in and out different heat you know i was walking around I was moving around more than i probably normally do because in the house these lips and i don't leave if i don't leave the house and i'm <laughs> i'm not gonna leave the house just so my lipstick lasts let me put it that way <laughs> but yeah though no, this one is lasting so this is here i got this brow like a boss ink brow gel from essence this says it's waterproof and it says it's going to last 72 hours so uh, we gotta try all this stuff out together because i haven't tried that yet either and then i got this beauties this is new from urban decay this is the cold day lip bond this is another one that's not supposed to budge it's supposed to last all day so i did get this nice nude shade called pleased so i'll be back too and we'll try that out did you guys see they were doing lots of demos on Instagram and they were, it was just not budging, you know, for people. So hopefully that will be the case for me as well. So I'll be back though and we'll try that out. So here is the other pair of lashes that I got from, this is the Iggy Azalea BH Cosmetics lashes. Those are glam lashes. So if you like glam lashes, they look very, we'll see though, but you know how it works out. They look very beautiful. So then I got here, this is a liquid blush from Milk Makeup, Bionic Blush. So I haven't tried that out yet. We'll try that out together. And then let's see here, I got this. I got another e.l.f. Putty blush in a different shade. This one is called Turks and Caicos. And I'm so sorry, I know so many beauties were asking me about the pink one that I had shown in the shorts. And the, the, na the, the, Oh, there is none. I thought I wore it off. No, there is no sticker on the back, so it's hard to see what color it is, uh, what what the name of the shade is. I don't know. Um, I felt so bad. I was trying to find it online. It's just a pink one. It's a it's like a baby pink one. Um, 
yeah the shade where do they write the shade do you guys know it's not it's not on the bottom is it written anywhere on the bot on the bottle let me know if you guys know where it's written i didn't think of looking there oh yeah it is written okay so i'll find let me look now at the pink one because it does say very small right here the name so um i will just you know we'll finish going through this and then i'll go grab the pink one so i could tell you guys the name of it uh let's just keep it moving i did pick this up this is the uh soft pinch dewy liquid blush in happy this is always sold out online from rare beauty so i picked it up i love you know what i was i love cream blush i'm addicted now but for a while i was just not into it my rare beauty the cream pot one the liquid any of them i just it didn't look good on me i didn't understand but now i use it with these kabuki brushes and they come out beautiful now my favorite is the charlotte tilbury but they have stopped making that i found out so if you use the tart brush i really want to grab it and show you guys oh my gosh it's it's beautiful let me let me grab it i have to show you beauties i was gonna come and you know i was planning to do a video and show you guys because i realized with the tart brush if you saw my shorts i showed how i use this kind of kabuki brush with the liquid blush it comes out so beautiful but the 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 um charlotte tilbury one you kind of bounce it but this one from tart you don't bounce it you pretty much don't let it leave your skin and you kind of oh let me show you guys how i i gotta do another video to show you but it comes out so your blush will come out so beautifully your cream blush specifically when you use a kabuki type of brush so this one you don't leave your skin you don't bounce it you just it doesn't leave your skin when you apply it it doesn't leave until you're done so this one is just not leaving the surface of my skin so it's just dragging it along my skin so when you this brush is amazing for that it's the same then as the uh the same effect as the charlotte tilbury hopefully this doesn't look cuckoo for cocoa puffs because i don't have murray believe it or not i don't have i i i'm gonna clean guys i'm gonna clean we'll clean together because that's the only way to get me clean is if you beauties to come along with me <laughs> so because i got a girl got clean just especially if you're like me and you just clutter stresses you out i got this too cluttered here i gotta go it's a lot of stuff gotta go again i gotta go i gotta clean out again guys oh here is the rare beauty blush this blush is gorgeous this is the happy from rare beauty now and like i said oh no this isn't a mirror okay oh here's the mirror here's here's the mirror oh god i'm gonna give myself an anxiety attack you guys i'm gonna give myself a back attack maybe i don't need any more blush you know what i got too much blush on like girl put the blush it looks like i got what chicken pox this rare beauty blush wow is gorgeous so beauties i got another one of these because i ran out and i said you know what i love that let me go get another one so this is the makeup forever ultra hd foundation stick this is invisible cover stick foundation amazing it beautiful 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 i really like to use that to conceal my under eye circles i really just put it like in here and then i do go over it with liquid foundation to you know blend it out and things like that but anyhow any who any here or there okay now this i purchased this is the revlon color stay over time lip this is like a dupe for chanel i was surprised though this looks like a nude shade here like a you know what a pinky nude i don't know but i didn't feel like this looked nude on my lips it didn't really pack a lot of punch the color it i didn't i didn't really didn't enjoy this and um so i don't know what to say about that that was not a good purchase <laughs> i really gotta start returning I, I feel bad though returning it but because i used it but you know it's i didn't like it and then i got the lip liner to go with it and the lip liner also i'm just not having good luck lately guys with the uh with my drugstore makeup because i got the revlon lip liner it was also dry the um brow pencil that i got the other day i don't, I don't have to show you guys i got this brow pencil from hard candy it was also so dry and you but i've realized if you really really work it and warm it up on like your arm or whatever you can get it going for you so um now this is this was one of them this was also this is the revlon uh color stay long wear lip liner also was very dry but maybe you know maybe yeah when you warm them up 
they work good maybe <laughs> maybe not i don't know i didn't I, it, it broke on me the the, the uh, lip liner just i'll give it another try but i wasn't happy maybe it was the lip because i wore it with that lip the lipstick and i didn't like it but i gotta tell you beauties this is flipping amazing this is drugstore wonder 2 brand i don't know if you've ever seen their brow products they have i don't know if they've always had this or what but i purchased this this is the wonder 2 must have matte lip liner this is budge proof this lasts and lasts and i got the shade burgundy but believe it or not this shade is so beautiful with so many of mauve lipsticks so actually i'm wearing it now it just you put the mauve lipstick over it and it just there is so complimentary it's not as deep as you would imagine for the shade burgundy it doesn't translate at least with my complexion it's i don't know it's beautiful and it lasts and it's creamy this is a dream this is my number one <laughs> one of my one of my number one lip liners right now but this is actually probably my number one lip liner it doesn't budge and then if you like to draw overline your lips it will stay in place it really you know doesn't wind up separating on your lips it doesn't bleed uh you know it stays wherever you draw your lip liner on it will stay and it, it doesn't transfer or anything like that so it's amazing and I got a lipstick from them I probably don't have it here it's my makeup bag because it's amazing it lasts and lasts it feels so smooth and so good on your lips oh my I'm gonna come back and we'll do a demo but then I also got this this is Ulta Beauty so this is a lip plumping gloss it looks beautiful I'll be back we gotta just try everything out together and let's see what else we got here I got another eyelash curler I bought two eyelash curlers I because I some of these things take a long time to get here, and this took, no, my eyelash curler that I ordered, Shishado, Shishado, did I say that right? That took so long that I forgot I ordered it, it came over a month later, I don't know why. But, anywho, um, the shish, it was worth the wait, because it's so big, it's much bigger than any other eyelash curler I've tried, so it goes, it hugs every single lash. It's, it's, oh my god, that Shishado eyelash curler is amazing. So then babies, I got this 24 hour brow setter from Benefit. But yeah, I could have sworn I used this the other day and I really think that somebody used it. This happens a lot where I live and they use it and they put it back in the box and they return it and then I get it home and there's no product left. This has happened multiple times. Has it ever happened to you beauties? Because and then I, I threw the box out so I can't even try to return it but there's nothing like i just bought this and there's nothing there's nothing in here but beauties i gotta tell you benefit has just come out with a new brow pencil which i'm gonna which i ordered it just didn't get here yet but it's a pencil that also volumizes it has volumizing fibers in the pencil so i'm really excited to try that like i said i didn't get here yet but when it gets here i will definitely be trying it out with you beauties right away so then I got here, this is Butter Believe It Pressed Powder from Physician's Formula Clean Beauty Makeup. I have never tried this before. I haven't gotten a chance. We should, <laughs> should we try it right now? I feel like I could use some of this. It looks so nice. Butter, it says it's going to smell good. I love the packaging. Oh, it has a very nice scent, like uh, almost like suntan lotion. Coke. Yeah, it smells like suntan lotion. That's so nice. And then I got here, I got another e.l.f. Halo Glow setting powder because I love it so much. So I got a different shade. I got a deeper shade just for fun. I got another pair of Lily Lashes. And I got this under eye brightener from Ulta. So we'll try this out too. So that's pretty much it for everything that I picked up this week. All my new makeup haul 2022. Uh, so I hope you beauties, my battery's going to die again beauties. Um, I'll be back though. So uh, thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me today. Let me know your favorites down below. Let me have tried any of these. Let me know what you've picked up this week that you're loving. I would love to know. So let me know down below. And I will see you beauties very soon. Bye.